Do you know the real reason why Sean Hannity divorced his wife? After a long time, a shocking truth revealed what you don't know. Sean Hannity and his wife Jill Rhodes quietly divorced more than five years ago after over two decades of marriage. As Sean and Jill are committed to working together for the best interests of their children, Jill the former couple said in a joint statement to People, adding that they separated years ago. Amicable agreements were entered into over four years ago between Sean and Jill. They maintain a close relationship as parents to their children. She neither will have any further comments and ask for sake of their children that their privacy be respected. Ja the statement concluded. Sean Hannity is not afraid to speak his mind on controversial issues, but the Fox News star is a lot more subdued when it comes to his personal life. As hard as it can be when you're in the public eye, Hannity kept his relationship with Ainsley Earhart under wraps for close to a whopping four years. Hannity, 58, and Rhodes, 57, share two children a son named Patrick and a daughter named Mary Kelly. The Fox News anchor and the former journalist tied the knot in 1993 and lived on Long Island, New York. Hannity is currently the host of his namesake political talk program, which first aired in 2009. Hannity made headlines last month after criticizing armed anti-lockdown protesters in the wake of the ongoing coronavirus pandemic. Hannity refused to address the speculation. E. I do not discuss my personal life in public, A. Eh, he said. Earhart went a step further, flat out denying it. E. I am not dating anyone, A. Eh, she said. The Fox News stars have kept their relationship status unconfirmed, but photos and videos published by the Daily Mail in April left very little up for discussion. Hannity and Earhart are pictured with arms locked and arms around each other during different family outings. The View co-host Joy Behar agreed with Hannity's stance, saying, Je things are really bad when even Sean Hannity is out there telling these crazy people to stop it. Just stop it. E. I come from the generation, as do you whoopee, where we protested the Vietnam War. Nobody was carrying a gun. Okay, Je Behar, 77, continued. E. That is not a protest. That is a terrorist act or the indication of it. I don't say that they are terrorists, but they are certainly intimidators. The report seemingly confirms their years-long relationship, though they still don't address it. It's not a surprise to anyone who knows them, but they're very private people and prefer to keep their personal life private and low-key, our source told the outlet. When rumors started swirling, Hannity was still supposedly married. But he had actually secretly divorced shortly before, showing he really is good about keeping his private affairs to himself. Earhart and Hannity were weirdly secretive about their relationship. One of the strangest things about Ainsley Earhart and Sean Hannity's relationship is how much energy they put into denying it. It's one thing to ignore rumors, but it's another thing to release a statement denying a relationship. When Earhart was asked about their relationship, she replied through an official spokesperson. Uh, right now, I am focused on raising my daughter, and I am not dating anyone. However, she added that anyone Hannity chose to date would be extremely fortunate. Hannity, on the other hand, outrightly refused to speak about Earhart, releasing a statement that said, G.I. do not discuss my personal life in public. Perhaps the stress of the denials finally got to them because, in 2023, Sean Hannity and Ainsley Earhart finally went public with their secret romance. The Daily Mail supplied pictures of them looking cozy and holding the same corn on the cob. They were even photographed at Palm Beach with Earhart's daughter, who was seven years old at the time. The couple has not been pictured with either of Hannity's two kids, who are in their 20s. Sean Hannity had been separated for years. Sean Hannity announced he had divorced Jill Rhodes in June 2020. But the couple had actually finalized the dissolution of their decades-long marriage in early 2019 before he was first linked to Ainsley Earhart. By that time, Hannity and Rhodes had been apart for several years. Amicable agreements were entered into over four years ago, they said in a statement to USA Today. Hannity and Rhodes tied the knot in 1993, two years after they met in Alabama. Rhodes worked as a political columnist for the Huntsville Times when Hannity snagged his first job in journalism at WVNN Radio. In fact, Hannity used to reach out to her to pick her brain. She finally fell for him after watching him at a mayoral debate in 1992. E.I. looked at his face and I said, that is the man I'm going to marry, as she told People in 2002. The former couple shares two children, Patrick and Mary, born in 1998 and 2001, whom they prioritized upon their separation. E. They maintain a close relationship as parents to their children. Je their statement to USA Today read. After getting together, Hannity and Earhart blended their families. The E. Fox and Friends co-host's only child, Hayden, was a toddler when her relationship with Hannity is said to have started, while Patrick and Mary were teenagers. As such, 
Hannity has reportedly become a father figure in the little girl's life. As Sean adores Ainsley's daughter Hayden, our source told the Daily Mail. So viewers, please like this video and subscribe our channel. Thanks for watching.